here's the thing as well. Okay, tinfoil hat time again. Tinfoil hats. Everybody got the tinfoil hat on? Okay, I'll give you a sec. Get your tinfoil hat. Tyranids, okay, and I, some of you are probably going to strongly disagree with me on this and are probably going to, you know, get huffy with me. Um, but Tyranids, Games Workshop, could always redo their product line. Why? Why could they always redo tier knits? They could always just update the models and change them, make changes, new poses, new new look, new styles, new things, right? Why? Because in the lore, they're constantly evolving, right? Tendrils of tier knits are not going to all look the same because this little tendril says, oh, you know, we're fighting a lot of chaos this way, so we're going to make more resistance and blah, 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 we're going to, you know, have more armor. Here, we're fighting lots of Imperial Guard and there's lots of laser beams and artillery and stuff like that, so we're going to go more armor and bigger crazy monsters and so this tendril, you know what I mean? So there's lots of excuses to change the look of Tyranids whenever they feel like it because within the lore, they're constantly evolving. So why not? Why not change? Like, Tyranids aren't you know, they don't have to be homogenous across the entire um, species or whatever the species of Tyranids is. They can be just basically like, uh, you know, I'm trying to think of what the hell the term, the term is. <clears throat> Where they're basically a, a, a certain kind of primordial thing and then it can morph into whatever they need it to be. And that maybe that's what like a, a Tyranid really is. This is just this amorphous DNA blob and it can shape itself into whichever way it needs to be for whatever task it needs to accomplish, right? So Tyranids could always be updated and Games Workshop could always update the look of Tyranids because the reasoning is right there in the lore that they're constantly evolving. So Games Workshop could make add-on kits, make brand new kits, introduce new units, take away units, right? They can always make changes to Tyranids because the Tyranids are constantly evolving. And the the storyline, the overarching storyline of Warhammer 40,000 is progressing, right? We're moving forward in, in time as far as where we were, you know, 20 years ago as far as where the universe sat to now, right? Where we went from Dark Imperium to now, uh, what is, what is, what is this latest? Fuck, I can't even remember. <laughs> Indominus. 